Sorry, I might have come round earlier. Um, listen, Dave, you, you couldn't walk us back, could you? Don't fancy walking back in the dark at this hour. Yeah. Get my jeans. Well, aren't you in the car? No, I've already locked it up, so I've walked round. Well, where's he? Why couldn't you walk you well, round? Well, he's busy, isn't he? He's in his dark room messing about. He's always in that bloody dark room. All right. Right, I'm going back to bed. Hey, don't stop drinking with Ian all night, either. We've got to think something to do about that letter in the morning. Don't fret, something will turn up. Yeah. See you. See you later. See you. See you. Shut the door. Has he got someone? Has he got the businessman? What's he like? Door when the lights flash. Your wine bottles, eh? You are. Dave, what's happened to you? Hey, hey, what's happened? Ian's killed the man. What do you mean, Ian's killed a man? With an axe. You mental. I've never seen anything like it. It's like it was just someone else. Something stop the fight. It wasn't a fight, Maureen. It was slaughter. If I'd have tried to stop them, they'd have done the same to me. Now, do you believe me? Yeah. Right, where's Myra? Myra's part of it. Myra? What's the messiest, dear? Mara? <laughs> Mara? Mara? What was that noise? It's nothing. 
finger on. I dropped a tape recorder on my foot. <clears throat> Go back to bed. No, no. I just... I just... I, I... I can't believe what you're saying about my being involved. She was, I'm telling you. I should have seen the look in his eyes when that first blow registered. I just wanted to get out of there. You. Clean that. It's all logical to them. Calm. It's been calm since we cleaned the room. Have a ciggy, drink some tea. Suppose I best be getting off. Don't worry in waking and finding me not there. Through the neighbours. What about your pram? <laughs> Angela's pram. <laughs> then that's it. Job done. And when I go, they give me this last look. Like I've passed the test. Tomorrow than I. What we're going to do? Well, go to the police. What else? Tell them what. Suppose Ian's realised I might do that. He, he, he might be waiting outside for me. Right, well, then. Well, well, then we wait till it's light. But we've got to do it. Hey, it'll be all right. We'll sort it out. I don't know, Maureen. I don't know. this about? Say they've seen somebody killed, sir. Oh, yeah. The lad's saying there's been a murder, but it's not to do with him. I don't know what to make of it, sir. He's on an apprentice. He's not going to solve your financial problems after all. Gotta take what you say at face value. You better take a look. We need his clothes, Sergeant. Right, Joe. Come on. Come with me. Yes, Jock Carr. I want to speak to WDC Clayton. It's me, Jock. 
pack, a lad named Edward Evans was murdered last night. Come on. Can you tell Joe Mouse to get over here? I'll explain when he gets here. Come on, son. They're ready for you. Come on. But he's admitted killing the lad. Thank Christ for that. He says you helped him. I watched, that's all. You got the lad's blood on you. He killed him right in front of me. I had to clear up, I had to kneel in it. What exactly did Maya do? Well, she called round for me, got me round the house. I mean, after Brady hit the lad with the axe. She watched, she helped clear up. Which is no more than what you said you did. But she planned it with him, she must have. Why would they plan a murder and get you to watch? I don't know. Well, if you don't know, son, why should we? Well, maybe it's because... Because what? Ian and me talked about robbing a bank. It was just talk, but he said he wanted to use guns. He told me he'd killed before, but I didn't believe him. Maybe last night was to prove to me that he could kill. And for you to do the same? I didn't kill that lad. Look, we spoke to Myra. She said she wasn't involved. She said it was you and Brady. And Brady says the same. So why should we believe you and not them? I came to you. Why would I do that if I'd murdered someone? To save your own neck. Yes, sir, where is it? I found this in the suspect's house, Mr Ian Brady. Anyway, it's just random jotings. There's a list of names here, all actors, mostly. So there's one name there that doesn't quite fit. John Kilbride. Mm. Good lad. What do you make of this John Kilbride's name in Brady's notebook? It'd be a complete coincidence. It's a bloody odd one, sir. Well, it hardly matters, does it? If Brady's admitted killing Evans, he'll get life for that. It matters to the family of John Kilbride. It may matter to the families of other dead children, sir. Well, if you want to pursue that, you're welcome to. Just don't get under our feet. No, Dave hates me, but I never thought he'd gone this far. Huh? What lies has Dave been telling? It's bad enough he's got Ian into trouble. But for him to make out mad is involved. Look, if you've done that, what do you mean, mean if? That's enough, come on. You're not saying you believe, Dave. I don't know what to believe, ma'am. Your sister. Your own flesh and blood. You stick by Dave and not Myra. You're no daughter of mine. <laughs> 